I am a man. Sometimes I put that manhood on display, like going skinny dipping in the sea on New Year's Day. I've gone up for third in an all-you-can-eat buffet, and I have not once worried about how much I weigh. I am a man. <laughs> Sometimes I do manly things. Not to prove I am a man, but that's just part of what it brings. So when I stay up playing FIFA on my PS3 till 4, it's not because I'm insecure, it's because it's fun. And some say that real men are brave men, and brave men are cavemen, and cavemen are men who do not really show emotion. I say, if something is real, that's something you can feel, and that could be love, religion, fear, or uncertainty, because real men have issues, and real men cry. That's why they make man-sized tissues for their man-sized <laughs> eyes. And I cry. And in this day and age, the romance eyes are dry and not determines that he may be gay, but I am not. I like a girl, I just cry like a girl at certain <laughs> things. And my main form of catharsis is Pixar flicks. The reason that I see them in the cinemas is so you cannot see my tears behind the 3D glasses. Because <laughs> I broke down in Up. And I wept in Toy Story 3. <laughs> was on the brink in Monsters Inc. and Cars did the same thing to me when watching Wally. I wasn't worried about which of my friends' willies was bigger cause something in an animation pulled an emotional trigger and you may snigger. Do you see these guns? <laughs> are not the manliest. But I figure that ain't the best way to measure manliness cause real men have issues and real men cry. That's why they make man-sized tissues not to be misused by never being kissed Jews in dimly lit rooms searching YouTube for big boobs. <laughs> but for the man-sized tears that run from man-sized eyes and the last one I used was watching Sky News when the story came through of a kid named Jordan Rice in Australia. In the worst floods in years that reduced many men to floods of tears when faced with death. He didn't hesitate or take a breath, just gave his life for his brother. So I cried for the brother who died for another age 13. The age a boy steps into manhood, he proved he could fill his boots as well as any man could, because real men are brave, right? Well, it don't get much braver. So yes, I am 19, I'm not the most prolific shaver. If anything, I only really weekly need a razor. <laughs> Maybe bi-weekly. <laughs> not as in twice weekly. As in once every two weeks, maybe even longer. Sometimes I am too weak and I wish I could be stronger. I did Movember and nobody even noticed. <laughs> but know this, I am a man, as are about half of you. Regardless who has been doing press-ups all afternoon and when I was 13, I stand on my head till the sky was green and the grass was blue. Then somewhere in this path I grew. So yes, I'm still a kid at heart and not ready to grow up, and if I go to Nando's, I drink too much Coke and throw up, but <laughs> here's something we can raise them refillable glasses to, because growing up is something not every kid gets a chance to do. <laughs>